So the convention next year, um, everything's moving ahead um, as planned for the narrow gauge convention in uh, Tacoma um, in September next year. So you guys have probably heard me say this several times before, so I'll be very, very fast, just in case there's some new people here. Um, it will be September the 1st to the 4th, 2022. That's Thursday through Sunday. So a day later than is normal. Normally it tends to go from Wednesday through Saturday night. Be aware of that. Uh, in Tacoma, Washington, and if you've never heard of Tacoma, of Tacoma, it's just down the road from uh, the Seattle Tacoma International Airport. Um, it's about a little bit further the other way from the airport as Seattle is to the north. It's, it's not it's pretty convenient, and it, we think we'll have um, better traffic from there to go around and see our layouts um, around here. Um, so those are the dates. Um, uh, the day after the convention ends is Labor Day, so that is a holiday, and I think you know, uh, that helps get better rates at a business-focused hotel. So the venue is a Hotel Murano in downtown um, Tacoma. It is a, a very nice business hotel. It's got all the facilities on site, including the former uh, City of Tacoma Convention Center is now a part of the hotel. They built a, a much bigger, shiny new one next door. Um, the room rates are there, $139 plus taxes with free Wi-Fi. Reservations are open on our website. There's a link on our website to get to that on the venue page, um, Seattle nngc.com for those details. We did have some hiccups with the um, the link to the reservations at first. It, it plane just didn't work and then there was behind the scenes some issues with how they'd assigned the various rooms. I am uh, fully believe those have been resolved now, but if you have any more problems, uh, let me know. Uh, info at seattlenngc.com or, um, or just call the hotel. As I mentioned earlier, it says it's a small local chain, um, and not a big national chain. In fact, I don't think they have more than a couple of hotels, one in Portland and one in Tacoma. Um, so they're very helpful and friendly and we'll try and get you sorted out um, at the front desk. The convention itself will do all the usual things you'd expect. You know we have lots of um, great layouts around the Puget Sound area here. We're building those up and actually have a backlog of um, layout photos and descriptions to add to the website, um, which Dale Kruzer and Roger Nelson have been putting together for us. So that's part of why I've been offline for the last month and coming back online now, I'll get those up on the website um, as soon as I can. Uh, we're getting the rules for the clinics, so, uh, for the contest sorted out rather, primarily what categories will we have? So we'll have those up on the website pretty soon. Uh, Dave Woodrell has put those um, uh, 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 categories and rules together. And um, Russ Segner, who you might have heard of, he's putting together our clinic program and making a lot of progress on that. And we've made a lot of decisions about that. And I think we've got the vast majority of them, uh, well, a lot of those slots actually lined up now with some great um, clinicians. Downtown Tacoma, where this hotel is, is actually within walking distance of a lot of cool stuff. Um, the Washington State History Museum is there, which actually has, I think, almost the whole top floor devoted to a wonderful HO layout, a very, very detailed layout of, um, of crossing the Cascade Mountains in the state of Washington. The uh, Chihuly Glass Museum is within walking distance. We have a little streetcar that runs up and down, which right now is free. I don't know if it'll be free next year. Um, and uh, we have um, the LeMay Classic Car Museum very, very close by too. There's good stuff to see down there. We will have some prototype tours set up as extra fare items. Um, we haven't uh, set those up yet. It's just been difficult to do uh, because of COVID. The actual venues have been shut down. So um, uh, we're working on those right now. Of course, we always guarantee beautiful sunny weather. As you know, anyone in the Puget Sound knows that today's been a beautiful, fine, calm, sunny day here in Seattle. Uh, the thunderstorm's just moving away as I look out my window right now. Um, so we're open for registration. Please do that. And thank you for everybody who has. I think we have about 70 uh, people registered, plus about 20 or 30 vendors already registered. That's great at this stage. Please keep it up. Uh, we, we do want to know how many people are coming. And as soon as you register, it really makes it much easier for us to plan um, the right um, uh, facilities <laughs> and to make sure we have enough rooms at the hotel for you. Um, uh, so please uh, keep registering at seattlenngc.com. That's about a bit about it from me. We hope to see you in um, in Seattle, Tacoma um, next fall um, uh, on the Labor Day weekend. And uh, I think it's going to be a great show and hopefully the world will be somewhat back to normal by then. So thank you. Any questions for me? Um, or, or you can ask me in the chat, um, but any questions for me? Or, or you can send them to that email address on the screen. But anything for me quickly?
Can I ask a question? This is John Mick. Yeah, go ahead, when John. Does, when does early registration end? Uh, we have a date for that, um, uh, but it will be sometime early in the new year. So um, I think we were thinking it might be around Easter time, maybe earlier. We're going to make a decision on that. We have a meeting next Monday. We'll make a decision on that pretty soon. But it will be certainly open at the early rate up until the end of the year. But then it is early, right? So it will go to the regular rate shortly, sometime in the new year.